Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to discuss what main method in Seesaw.net. So, what the main method? So, main method is the entry point of the program where the program that start and end. So, if you debug the code, so it's a displaying high. So, at your first, that control comes to main method here after that, go inside and let's do the processing of the code. So, if you like to know how, so go to the step info and here. Uh, so see first control comes to main method here or uh, see or uh, the cursor it's a uh, displaying this point yellow color now here after let's uh, step info now control comes to console dot right line and here after step info one more time control add here so main method part has been over now that out from the main method so main method is the entry point of the program where the uh, processing is start and end now here after let's copy that one and paste it down so add here so if you debug the code so definitely you will get the error because in a program main method it only one time the program already defined main called main with the same parameter so that means main method only one time so if you remove this one and if you execute so again, I'm getting the error. So at your program has more than one entry point. So here, so that means in this of dot end, so there must be only one entry point. So there must be only one entry main method. Entry point main method. Now if you delete here, so no any error. Now I execute. So you cannot find any error at here. Our, our here are two, one more thing. So if you don't want ARGS, so let's remove that and if you execute, so add here, it's a, no any error and it's a display the suitable output. So uh, 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 string ARGS is the optional part add here. So here let's uh, copy that one and here you can just remove this part and if you execute now. So at your compiler understand there are two main method. So here this is the main method. The program already main method has the same parameter. So that means in a program there must be one entry point. So let's remove that one. But at your, if you give at a different uh, uh, parameter. So let's give at your int k. So this main method or this math main, main method are different. So that here is a not displaying and any error. Now here after let's see some formats of the main method. So first you can use this or uh, this uh, way or you can write at here this way. Asking ARGS so this is the optional part. Now here after you can give at here end. So if you give at here end so at here you have to write return. So return one now here you can you have to write so no any error add here or you can just remove this one if you don't want here so here you can get the same output now here after let's paste and here let's give so here there are two main methods so if you give change some parameter now here I'm going to change the parameter int k. Now if you uh, debug the code, so that will display some output, no any error add here. So hi, it's a display. So that means this main method, so this is the main entry point and here this main method are different. So if you debug add your step info, so first control comes to this point. So this is the entry point main method. Now here after the next thing is, so suppose if you give add here parameter like int or c. So add here if you do uh, execute, so first it's the displaying the error. The program already defined member. So main method already defined. So this main method now let's give add here int different parameter int c and int k. Now if you execute, so add here getting the error message the reason of error masses at here 
the program does not contain a static main method suitable for entry point. So that means in uh, CSR.NET program, there must be one entry point main method. So that here it's a display program does not contain a static main method suitable for entry point. So these are the things here. Now if you give item one entry point, so see there is a one entry point main method is there. Now let's execute that. So add here no any error, it's a display. So this main method, this main method add here uh, are three different main method. So this is the entry point main method. Now here after let's remove this part. So in this main method you can give at here private. So let's execute that. So it's so no any error it's a display. Or here you can write end user. So if you give at here end user so you have to use return 0 or 1. So if you execute so see at here why it's a display. Now here after I'm not going to oh okay do one thing let's test add here I just remove the static part so let's see what happened so there is a no any static part so see at here getting the error masses so the reason of error masses program does not get a static main so entry point so here or oh, with this entry point main method so a static keyword or essential. So a static here must be must be necessary must be used at here. So program does not contain a static main method so therefore entry. And here let's so let's remove at here white execute. So here getting the error masses. So must have return time here. So program this one. A static construction must be parameter so that means here must be white so this is the uh, some important points about the main method so main method uh, in every program you have to use main method so main method is the entry point where the program that start and end so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you